Okay, so <clears throat> it's at night and I just wanted to um, show you guys something. You may notice the Better Prey Type R and the Better Prey LT. They have the same uh, spring load, the Explore 18K, the um, Orange Mod Works 11, um, well it's actually, it is 11K, but it is actually rated at 8 kilograms because that's its partial. On this thing, you can go all the way back and go 11K on that spring. Um, and you may notice that um, the LT, like right now, you can see LT has a short bill on it. At, at the uh, second armor getting I ever played at, I broke out the LT and I was shooting with this barrel. Okay, this one had broken. I had loaned it to somebody and they stuffed a dart into here, which is why I don't really loan out the R very much anymore. And um, it was um, I was, uh, and then I pulled one of my arm muscles and I couldn't use my long shot because I had modded it to about 26 kilogram. So I was stuck with just this blaster. However, this blaster I did really, really phenomenally well. Um, at the point, at that point, it had 30 kilograms, but there were three springs that were short. These ones are all long shot length, so there's a lot of pre-compression in here. The blaster was doing about 220, 230 feet per second that day. Nowadays, it you'll see shots into the 180s. Okay. Why does the LT have a shorter pledge tib? A uh, friend of mine asked. Okay. Number one, the blast this blaster was made for shorter barrels. It was made also for a turret, which there is a turret adapter, but because I did some internal stuff here, I have to I have to fix the turret adapter. Where did I put it? Oh, I have no idea. But and anywho, you guys have seen that peg that comes out here, and then I have the AT2K with the Roman turret on it. Okay, right. That's number one. It's made for turrets. Number two, it's made for shorter barrels. But it is not by it is the baby bird of prey. But it is not by any means slow. If you've seen the recent numbers, numbers going as high as as high as 275, as high as 280, really fast. Okay, it's just made. It just has a smaller volume. It has a smaller uh, pressure ratio to make a smaller barrel and to make it practical. If I put the same on here, which is two and a third, now these look the same draw, but they're not. You see how that's that's knocked them by hand, okay? And this is not, see? This is about a third of an inch shorter draw than one of these. Um, it's only two inches of draw rather than two and a third. You might be very surprised when you see this. Look at that. 265 feet per second. Okay. Now, how long is this barrel? It looks long, except if you look down the barrel, there's about an inch and a half of, um, of 9 sixteenths on it. That means that our effective barrel is only that long. That's it. That's how much 17 30 seconds. This is only six and a half inches of 17 30 seconds barrel. Okay. Whereas this, that's a that's a 10 inch barrel, and this barrel is 13 inches. As you can see, it's quite loud with the shorter barrel, but it's accurate. As a shot in the Armageddon video. We'll actually see me pick off somebody from the grass to the uh, baseball court, and it's about 130, 140 feet away. Hit! And right at the beginning of the round, I just pop, hit him, you know? Not a very hard with this blaster with open sights, actually, to hit people at that range, given that your darts are right, you don't have wind, everything else. 